the Supreme Court is the highest court. Their decision is binding. I respectfully disagree with some portions of their decisions, but it's the final court. So if at this level you have any disagreement, the only appeal you have is to God Almighty. Maybe we may have to resort to that at the appropriate time. Can you give clarity as to what you mean by that? Well, the decision has just been given. We need time to digest it. But it's, um, it's unfortunate that I did not hear about the issue of the forfeiture whatsoever. And the position of the law is that the courts would is under a duty to talk on all the issues presented by the party. And we presented the issue of forfeiture uh, as a fine imposed on the second respondent for the proceeds of uh, narcotics and um, money laundry by the District Court of Illinois. I sat down through, I did not hear it, and I wonder whether that was uh, swept under the carpet or was an oversight because the lead judgment was detailed on all other issues and they said all the issues there have been overtaken by event in all our own issues and I did not hear the issue of the forfeiture. And so that's why I said I disagree respectfully even though the decision is binding. The only paragraph the Supreme Court brought to the notice of the world, which was quite interesting, is that even the Supreme Court agreed that non-uploading of the result on IRA reduced the confidence of the people in the election. I heard it clearly. Meaning that even the Supreme Court agrees that the election was not credible or as credible as it ought to have been if the result was uploaded. So credibility is one of the three arms of an election for the people. Free, fair, and credible. Credible means believable. Why shut out the people for the right the law has given unto them? So I was very glad that the Supreme Court pointed it out that non-uploading of the result reduced the confidence of Nigerians in it. Meaning that it cannot be presumed to be credible because Nigerians were shot out in it. So I loved that particular part.